Hey guys, welcome back to another Coding Flamingo video. So in this video, we're going to look at how to create a Windows tray icon for your MAUI application. And so if we compare our current MAUI application with, let's say, like PowerShell, and here you can see it's a little kind of naked on the top tray. So today we're going to add the icon and in the next video we're going to add the title. So make sure to subscribe so you don't miss the next video. And this video, there's going to be a lot of copy pasting since a lot of it is just kind of copying what Windows needs. There is no real coding. So the link to the code is going to be down below to my GitHub. And I actually made a, a full commit. So I'm going to link the commit itself so you can see all the files that we added and what you have to do for your application. But let's jump into it. It is pretty straightforward. Uh, all you, we did is copy all this folder, the native Windows folder, into our Windows folder inside platforms. And then we added this tray service icon that is basically just telling it to add the Windows tray. But if you see here, it is actually implementing an interface and that interface is going to be in our services. And the reason for that is the tray service is going to be different for Windows and for Mac and so on. So you have to create an interface. And then in the MAUI program, we say if Windows add the singleton of that interface with our Windows tray service icon. Another thing we have to add in the main program is just the lifecycle here. And as I said, all of this is just kind of copy pasting what Windows needs to run the service. And the last thing we did is we once again copy and pasted this Windows extension and we do use P invoke. And for that one, we have to install P invoke user 32 and that's it. After that, we're ready to run it. And it's going to use the same icon as you use for your bottom trace. So by default, it comes with this .NET one. So as you can see here, now it has the same icon on the top and down here at the bottom. So that's how you add a tray icon to your .NET MAUI application. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.